Hello, friends and enemies. It's me, V. Besides the obvious, how are you all doing today? Um, this is what will be the beginning of October or Vlogtober. Yeah, I'm going to try that out. <laughs> no idea how the hell that's going to work. Um, you're supposed to be, you know, shooting videos and do all sorts of stuff. Um, since I'm probably going to, no, I, I, I said not probably. I know for a fact I'm going to be doped up. After they extract the last three uh, wisdom teeth, I realized, hey, I should probably um, make this video now. So if you're seeing this, hey, this is past Veronica. Current Veronica is not able to talk and won't be able to talk for at least four days without it hurting. And I'm not even lying. That's when they pulled out this tooth, my uh, top right wisdom tooth. It hurt like a motherfucker. And that was, um, it hurt like a motherfucker when it, it was all done. Just because there was a hole and then there was blood. And then anytime I talked, air would hit that little blood clot. And even now, if I, if I sing, I was singing to Britney Spears, the air hit that little, that little whatever palate or blood clot is left. And I was like, ooh, I don't like this. And it's been a week. A week. Since this happened. So that since this is the first day, I decided I'm going to show you guys what I did today. Or rather, no, I'm not going to show you what I did today because there's no re reason to. What I'm going to instead do is an unboxing of what? Misfits. Misfits. I have my every plate here. Um... Yeah, I have that box. We're going to open this bad boy in a second. This is what comes in your actual box. Now, with Misfits, you can purchase as many things as you want, as long as they all equal up to $30. They even have, you know, their own um, grocery section. And by grocery check, let me quit Quentin Tarantino things back. Now, when you go to the website, the way they have everything situated is fruits, veg then they have households um by household i mean they have uh your pet care or pet food if you want to buy that a little bit they have gluten-free items if you want to do gluten-free i have a gluten-free cake that i have not yet touched um i bought two different ones i bought gluten-free tacos which are actually delicious and um i I had, before I got this tooth taken out, like that day, I made tacos and I was like, ooh, I made the taco meat and I had the tacos. I'm like, after they do my cavities, then I'm going to go eat this and then I'm going to be in pain for a couple of days, you know, a couple of time, nights because my entire night time was just me. Um, it was more or less just me in pain, which kind of sucked. Um, my tooth would hurt at eight or nine at night while I'm at work. And then I would get home, try to sleep, take Adv, not Avo, but ibuprofen, acetaminophen, acetaminophen, acetaminophen. I would take, I would try to take a Tylenol and some other stuff. And what, would it work? Kind of. Oh, this is, first thing you're going to get is a wet semi Oh, that doesn't bode well. It's leaking. Oh, okay. So this is not part of it, but guess what I bought? I bought skinny dips. I bought keto puffs that I thought were much bigger. I bought veggie puffs. Um... When you're hyped up on pain meds, sometimes you buy things that you look back at and say, why did I buy it? Like French bread. I like French bread, but I uh, can't really eat it now, can I? Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm upside down. Hopefully you didn't see my underwear. Rich crackers I got for $2 for a box. I also got vegetable pho. Because I was like, I want some. 
I have sweet potatoes. Uh, I bought sweet potatoes. I also bought apples. Oh no, this is the tomato. This is the uh, tomato. Tom tom tom. Tomilla. Tom tom I'm gonna figure out how to. I'm gonna figure out how to say them. I bought these. I bought these because I wanted to try them. My sweet potatoes that were two for ninety nine cents. I got four of them because a uh, bitch wants her her uh, she wants them. I also got black plums. I wanted some black plums. And they are hard as fuck. These are hard. Holy shit, these are hard. Uh, they, these are hard as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, what I'm gonna do is leave them out till they soften because I like my plums really soft. I will say that I had a mango from here. It was hard. It was hard, so I put it in the refrigerator. I left it over there for a month. Uh, the second day of my tooth, you know, bothering me and have, after having it removed, I took it out, I cut it open, it still was, you know, still smelled sweet, tasted sweet. Um, there may have been a little bit part that was rotten. I just cut that off, but I was just eating it and it was, it was juicy and I was like, oh my gosh, I wish I could really, you know, eat this, but I'm with all the strings and everything. I don't know, but... Yeah, it was delicious. Um, I got my scallions for 99 cents. More sweet potatoes, because I was thinking I would make myself sweet potato mash. How many sweet potatoes did I buy? Oh, I bought a potato. And I also bought pears. Is this the pears? No, this is a pumpkin spread. I bought pumpkin spread because I was like, hey, let's get some, let's get some sh I've never tried. I've never tried pumpkin spread. I like pump. I, do I like pumpkin pie? I like sweet potato pie. I don't know about pumpkin pie, but let's try it. This is, and I got it because it's vanilla and cinnamon spiced pumpkin pie. Not pumpkin pie, but pumpkin spread. And I'm like, let's try it. I also got a red onion. Hey, wait a minute. Where are my white onions? No. Or did I delete the white onions? Maybe I deleted the white onions. But that's what I got. What am I going to do? I'm going to eat this. Because uh, they said that, you know, slowly work your way into eating the soft things. I was thinking uh, I was going to try and make this a salsa if I could. Because I miss salsa. I miss spicy stuff. Do you know, the day before I got my, my tooth taken out, the my my food from every plate came in, had spicy stuff. I was like, cool, I'm going to be eating this stuff. And they were like, you can't have anything spicy. I just finished an entire week. I miss spicy food. I don't know what it is, but I like it. Um... I had bought dip and chips because, again, they've got gluten-free chips if you've never had them. They're delicious. Um, I can't eat any of those. According to several different websites that I've been searching and looking at, I'm looking at four weeks of not eating that because, you know, small particles of my chips could get into my, my hole, my 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 mouth hole I'm I'm a little I'm 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 fucking upset right now I'm gonna let you guys go because as I sit here I'm upset this is bullshit I mean I'm glad to have my teeth my tooth out but holy hell I miss I bought queso do you know oh I bought I thought I really was gonna use this 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 is my favorite dip. This is my favorite fucking dip. This is queso. Uh, it's sete, sete, sete. It's dairy-free queso. It's sete or sete. Is it sete? Siete? Siete? I have no idea what the hell it is. I know that it's an actual veggie. veggie and, um, no, I think this is actually with the cashews. Yep, 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 yep. 
This is with the cashews. I apologize. This is using yeast cashews. The other one I want to say is the one that used pumpkin core. I, uh, I'm trying to remember. The reason I'm saying this is because I tried one of them. They had them. And by them, I mean market, misfit market had them. And it's one of those things where you're like, ooh, awesome, cool. And they were like, it's no dairy. And it's no, you know, no dairy because it's made from pumpkin core or cashews and yeast and all this different stuff. And I was like, I don't know. Um, put it in the microwave, got it hot, started eating the chips with it. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is fucking delicious. Oh my God. I'm looking at the chips right now and I'm looking at this. Ah, I miss this. And the chips... And I got the tacos. Oh, I'm not, I'm not having to, oh, pray for Mojo. Pray for Mojo. And as always, fuck Tom Brady.